Well, husband and wife duo John Krasinski and Emily Blunt are starring in the new movie, A Quiet Place. The movie, which is a horror film, has earned a decent amount of buzz because it is primarily silent. But does all that silence keep you on the edge of your seat? Entertainment reporter Sandy Canyon is here now with the details. Sandy. Liz, every so often a film just sneaks up on me, and such was the case with this one. A publicist who knows my taste made me go and see A Quiet Place just before all that buzz began. Turns out Patricia was right to insist. The movie is called A Quiet Place because a family in upstate New York must remain silent so as not to be attacked by aliens who can't see, but do respond to sounds and will hurt you if they can hear you. Emily Blunt and John Krasinski are married on screen just as they are in real life. And two extraordinary young performers, one of them deaf, play the couple's children. They're so open-minded and they're so calm and they know exactly what they want. Krasinski, who also wrote and directed this film, has made us laugh so often, he admits. I don't think that my name is the name that people are like, that guy's gonna do a horror movie one day. But A Quiet Place grew out of his experience as a father of young daughters. And the film gave him his first chance to work with his wife, Emily Blunt. In the film, they have lost a child and are now expecting another, which gives extra depth to action that starts slow and then builds from there. I scare easily, which is why I tend to avoid horror movies, but this one is made so well without a single wasted second. It's that rare film I can recommend without reservation. Family, there's no more important word. I didn't expect to like Chappaquiddick as much as I did. The story of how a young woman came to be killed in a car alongside Senator Ted Kennedy is riveting. Jason Clark doesn't look much like him, but somehow manages to embody his mix of arrogance and intelligence. We tell the truth, or at least our version of it. Mm, the behind the scenes drama to save Senator Ted Kennedy's political career is a fascinating portrait of a cover-up, lots of hypocrisy involved. Jason Clark is from Australia, yet has proven himself to be a true chameleon and worthy of playing a politician who was more charismatic than most movie stars. You can also see my review for Isle of Dogs on our website. Go to abc7ny.com entertainment.